Why do you know I know deep down you really hope this gives you clout? Remember when your baby mama caught you scoping out her house? Woo! Now throw your hands in the air and wave them like you just don't care. And if you like fish and grits and all that pimp sh everybody li Everybody let me hear you say, oh yeah, yeah. Now throw your hands in the air and wave them like you just don't care. And if you like fish and grits and all that pimp, everybody let me hear you say, oh yeah, yeah. Put that in the comment section, classic something. Uh, only, only, it's your only. Guess who the Dax this one on my coach, your boy SFJ. We are here. Yeah, we are here. On the road to 500,000, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Yeah, somebody do some trash away. And um, what else, what else, what else? 313, my first single of 2020. I'm dropping on January 16th. Make sure you follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Keep up with the post about that and all the news. And yes, I heard about Dr. Dre having an aneurysm and going to the hospital. I didn't tweet or say nothing about it because um, I didn't know what was going on. I, I felt so weird about it. I didn't want to tweet about it. I'll be, I'm superstitious. Let me just go ahead and tell y'all. I didn't want to say nothing. But he's responsive and he said he's okay. So first of all, that's the most important thing. Shout out to Doc Dreezy because there, listen, if there is one person, one person in hip hop that would have the biggest ripple effect if they never touched hip hop, it would literally be Dr. Dre. Just think about it. That's not even just, say, that is something that I've said my whole life. There, if there was one person out, in order to get the same ripple effect of Dre, of like everything Dre's done, what the hell, hold on. You would have to take out multiple people. You feel what I mean? Like, he spends generations from, from when he was the Dr. Dre scratching to Kendrick Lamar. You feel what I'm saying? So, that's important. But anyway, Mercules apparently got into this uh, Benzino beef. Benzino just any, just going at everybody. And, you know, Benzino, I mean, Mercury's a rapper, so he went straight for him, dropped the diss track right away, and we gonna react to it, you feel me? And then there's a little clip, I think Benzino uh, responded to it, and we gonna react to that too, so. We gotta see what's going Matrix or something? Can somebody slap me and wake me back up? Am I actually beefing with Benzino right now? That's the, well, hold on, first of all, my light, I don't understand why my light is so, being so disrespectful right now, hold on. That's another thing that I was thinking too, like, man, we are really in the twilight zone right now, that Benzino is. Listen, even in my inbox talking shit for almost two years now, my G. Oh, okay. I was about to say, I don't know what made them get into this, but dang. Benzino been going hammy in his comment, I mean in his section, and in his uh, messages. Oh my goodness. I've been to your city, I've sold out shows, you weren't there. I can't believe I'm wasting a beat this good on you, bro. Like, give me my 10 minutes back, honestly. Wake up and smell the coffee, old man. Let's go to work. Picture this. The year is 2021 and I'm beefing with Benzino. Wow. He is depressed and he looks at me like the next Chico, oh, but he is a mess. He just injects needles at D-ball and he's so obsessed with them that he won't never let the beef go. Bro. Ooh, ooh. The problem going to be, the problem going to be Benzino beefing with, he, he, he just shooting at anybody who may seem like they have any uh, opposing things. So, dang, Mercury's has had this one loaded for a while, huh? Get out of there. You are not a rapper, you're a clown. He put the nail in your coffin, I dug your back out of the ground. I'll put your ashes in the backwood and I'll pass that shit around. You're so ashamed of the real you that you act like someone else. Uh -huh. This nigga said he will put your ashes in the backwood and pass it around. Wow. He said packs. He said you gonna make a fresh pack. Hey, pack, pack? Okay, yeah. Bill Raymond's got you tater tots. You pray to God I'll make it stop. Them and them won't take your cause. I know that really breaks your heart. Them steroids you take and leaving heroin scabs. You got the same fucking jawline as American dad. <laughs> I hear them bad. From Zeno, where's your therapist at? You're 55 wearing skinny jeans. That's terrible swag. All those needles you injecting got you foaming at the mouth. The only 60 year old rapper with an OnlyFans account. Wow. And even though I know deep down you really hope this gives you clout. Remember when your baby mama caught you scoping out her house? Woo! Yeah, he did his. He, 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 he did. 
It's the messenger. I seen Benzino say some things in his live that I was reacting to. And he'd be like, why was I the only person that da, da, da. And it's like, man, you, you, you just, you just not, you just must not be that self-aware. You must not have like a team of people around you. Cause if you were strategizing to take down M or, or, or bring some big thing to light, this was the worst way to do it. And this is not the first time you've done this. This ain't the third time you've done it this way. So. You a weirdo. You thinking you're the man on the gram, but at the end of the day, you're just Stan's biggest Stan. I'm going to take him to the old folks home. Watch me take him to the old folks home. You're a fucking senior. I'm going to take him to the old folks home. Watch me take him to the old folks home. Don't forget your pills. I'm going to take him to the old folks home. I'm going to take him to the old folks home. Do you need help up the stairs? I'm going to take him to the old folks home. Watch me Take them to the old folks. These kids nowadays catch right? me in Boston, Massachusetts with an automatic shooting. If I don't hit Benzino, I bet a heart attack will do it. Oh. So fuck the magazine now, I'll just call you the source. Cause that's exactly what you are every time you appear in court. Rap bastard, Botox injections, you made a plastic. Pull the nail out your cop. He said you the source every time you in court. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Merck a rapping, a rapping mouth. He, he. <laughs> Catch me with an end with an end shooting. Uh-oh. Is that what you want, Merc? Okay, yeah. Talk, talk greasy then. Looking just to take a shit in your casket. I'm laughing. Remember the time that his chick slapped out. What happened? He's trying to paint this as some white and black shit. I'm breaking his facial tissue for making these racial issues. And I'll film it just to laugh at the face you make when I hit you. You a pussy cat. Suffer and suck a tash. You fucking whack. Take your five mics and shove them right up your fucking ass. You on Instagram in tight clothes. Acting hostile seven years ago. A member of your own family shot you. I'm in your... Oh my God. One thing I'm gonna say is Mercules. He a different type of rapper, man. He not he not. First of all, he doing he doing he he, he giving the I being uh, about dude with an automatic shoot, giving you different word plays and rhyme syllables and, and stuff like that. But he's for the most part keeping it very simple. And I think that's the best way when you do this track so the punches and everything land a bit easier for the layman. You know what I mean? For the regular person who doesn't really, can't conceptualize lyrics very well. So like, huh. I mean, Benzino might as well just respond. And like, <laughs> you, you, if you was in the, if you was in the messages for that long, you was, you was going in that crazy, you might as well. You might as well. What it, what it, at first, because I didn't know how um, Mercules got involved with it. But then when you see that, it's like, bro, you've been in his, in his message for two. What, why? Like, and Benzino's strategy is just be telling everybody, like, man, you don't know. You wouldn't make it around here. You wouldn't do it. It's like nobody's even making that argument, bro. I don't think, I don't know. I'll be trying to talk, I'll be trying to talk sometimes and like penetrate his psyche, but I don't think that's, good. I think he got like actual anger issues, like actual like mental issues, because this ain't, it, it shows in different aspects of his life, so it's like. Suffer and suck a tash, you fucking whack. Take your five mics and shove them right up your fucking ass. You on Instagram in tight clothes, acting hostile seven years ago. A member of your own family shot you. I'm in your city twice a year, check me please. You're too busy snorting coke off M and M C Ds. Oh I'ma take him to the old folks. I won't watch me take him to the And I like I like I like uh y'all know I like Merck's level of spice. I like it. He said I'm in your city twice a year. I I like it. It's very respectable. It's very, if, if, if that's how he coming with it and he there with it, then they he there with it. What we doing? What we doing? Like, 
Mer Merch said, okay, yeah. To the old folks home. You're a fucking senior. I'ma take him to the old folks home. Watch me take him to the old folks home. Don't forget your bills. I'ma take him to the old folks home. I'ma take him to the old folks home. Do you need help up the stairs? I'ma take him to the old folks home. Watch me take him to the old folks home. These kids nowadays, am I right? Look, this is what <laughs> I love the these kids nowadays, am I right? I love that. That's some stand-up comedy shit. That's that's really like, cause I hate when when people be like, man, kids nowadays. Like, uh, I, I I like what he was meaning by that bar. Uh, this is this is pretty potent. When you got no legs to stand on anymore, so you try to make everything about race. You try to pit everybody against each other. That shit doesn't work anymore, bro. Listen, at the end of the day, your career died a long time ago, man. You spent your whole career watching your peers blossom and become legends. All you did was remain at the bottom. Now you're taking these measly checks, doing club hosting events, starting an OnlyFans account just to get by while all your old friends are rolling in millions. You spent all your time in the gym lifting weights and trying to fill the void inside you to damage your ego because you're a little boy inside, bro. Every day you look in the mirror and think that because you got some muscles, you're cool as everybody else. But listen, you watch those people succeed and you got nowhere. We're done here. I said it before. I hope you sleep well tonight. OG. Oh my gosh. I think that end might have been psychologically m m just as potent or more potent than the whole disc. He got he got psychological with it. Hold on. Now let's see B M uh, Benzino's response. It's only 28 seconds, so. He's out. This nigga left the country. Now she gotta go find him. No. No, 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 no. That's it. It's a wrap. It's over. Mm. Ain't gonna find me. Sorry. No. Better know next time. You're gonna be like, ah, yeah, I.